What's up, Bob Penguins? Today we're going to do AP Bell Math Minute looking at Hardy Weinberg. And this is actually from the 2013 exam number 121. So we have some people and they can taste a certain bitter chemical. The ability to taste that chemical is one dominant allele. And so we see that a non-taster, so homozygous recessive, is 45%. We need to figure out what is the percent that are homozygous dominant and give that number to the nearest hundredths place. So here's our equation. So we know from the equation that Q squared is our homozygous recessive, 2PQ is our heterozygous, and P squared is our homozygous dominant because P is dominant and Q is recessive. So we're looking for our P squared and we know our Q squared. So we're gonna use our chart to fill it in. So we know that of course that Q squared is gonna be 0 0.45 because it's given in the prompt. We take the square root of that and that's gonna give us our Q value. So our Q value is going to be the square root of 0 0.45, which is 0 0.67. Then P plus Q equals one. So one minus 0 0.67 gives us our P, which is 0.33. We square that to find that our P squared value is 0 0.1089. And then our 2PQ will just be our two times our P times our Q, which is gonna be 0 0.44. So since we're looking for our p squared and we want to give it to the hundredths place you know that it's going to be 0 0.11 hope this was helpful remember that eight bow penguins just assessed by y'all